See, they have given one diagram, and uh, he is asking us to find area of asteroid x is equal to a x cube theta, y equal to a sine cube theta, by employing Green's theorem. So he he has given only parametric equations. Okay. So and he is asking using the Green's theorem, you solve it. Okay. So. For that sake, what we'll do is by Green's theorem, in a plane. So we'll write the previous formula. That is double integral over a region R dx dy is equal to one by two integral. Uh, uh, x dy minus y dx. Okay, so this one is equal to half into here. He has given x value and y value. Just substitute it directly. X equal to a cos cube theta, and similarly y equal to A sine cube theta, sorry. A sine cube theta. Okay. So implies what will be the derivative of x with respect to theta? So that means d x by d theta is equal to Is Atmika? Can you say say this derivative? Atmika. Drisha. Shreya, Manjusha, are you there? Yes, sir. Ah, can you tell the derivative of this? Three a cos square theta. Three a cos square theta into hmm. minus a sine cube. Huh? A sine cube theta. Ye won't come. Only this much will come. Cos cube, cos theta. So I'll get differentiation of cos theta minus sine theta. I'll get. Similarly, dy by d theta. D A sine square theta into cos theta. Sine square theta into cos, cos theta. theta. Yes, that's it. So implies D X value will be minus three A cos square theta into sine theta, comma, sorry, into D theta. This D theta I'm sending here. Similarly. dy is equal to 3a sin square theta into cos theta a theta okay so implies what happens substitute in this equation okay so implies area of asteroid Is equal to. If you observe this diagram, so here in all the four quadrants we have equal areas. Okay. Instead of finding area of all the quadrants, I'll find area in one quadrant. Okay. So that my work will be reduced. So I can write this one as one by two integral value. I am taking from zero to pi by two. 
so that means only first quadrant area i'm finding and i am taking four times of it correct so first part second part third part and fourth part if you do it part wise you can multiply directly because these are all the equal parts okay so i can write this one as 4 into area of a plane is how much 1 by 2 integral x dy minus y dx where the limits are ranging from 0 to pi by 2 okay so if you put this what happens it will calculate only sorry it will calculate only this part okay so we will find only this part area and we will multiply four times of it so that we'll get area of this complete region okay so we are still we didn't substituted uh, theta so i have we have to erase it so i'll put so the curve c after substituting x and y values you can put limits as 0 to pi by 2 so here how much will get two ones two twos so 2 into integral 0 to pi by 2 that means only first quadrant area i am taking i have multiplied with 4 here okay so next uh, x value is how much a cos cube theta okay next into dy dy value is 3a sin square theta into cos theta d theta okay similarly minus of uh y dx y value is a sin cube theta into minus 3a cos square theta into sin theta d theta okay so this one is equal to 2 into integral 0 to pi by 2 so here which one is common <clears throat> 3a square is common here okay you can write that 3a square outside into 3a square you can take common integral 0 to pi by 2 so let us write the remaining thing so i'll get cos power 4 theta into sin square theta minus sorry minus of minus we'll get we'll get plus sin power 4 theta into cos square theta d theta so this one is equal to 6a square okay integral 0 to pi by 2 okay so is there anything common here in these two terms cos theta cos square theta so cos square theta into sin square theta okay so we'll get cos square theta in the first term plus sin square theta in the second term d theta so that it is reduced to one term so this value is 1 So six a square integral zero to pi by two. Okay, cos square theta sine square theta is there. I can write it as cos theta sine theta whole square d theta. So this one is equal to six a square integral zero to pi by two. How can you write this? Since we know. Sine two theta value is how much? Two sine theta cos theta. Okay, so this is a trigonometric formula or a trigonometric identity. In so you have to remember it. I am going to substitute this. So I'll get if you send this two to that side, sine two theta by two. So I'll get sine two theta divided by two whole square. 
d theta. Okay, so this one is equal to how much you'll get? In denominator, you'll get four. Okay, so that four I'm taking outside six a square by four integral zero to pi by two sine square two theta d theta. Okay, so next this one is equal to three a square by two. Since because here two threes two twos get cancelled, so three a square by two integral zero to pi by two. How to integrate sine square theta? How can you write sine square theta? Minus square. One minus one. Uh-huh. We have to convert this in terms of uh, sine of or cos cosecant of uh, something. We have one direct formula, right? One minus cos two theta by two. Because one minus cos two theta. Is equal to two sine square theta. We have this result. Okay, from this I have taken two. Uh, I have sent this two to this side. So we'll get sine square theta equal to one minus cos two theta by two. Okay, so this result I am going to use now here. Sine square theta equal to one minus cos two theta by two. Fine. So integral zero to pi by two, one minus cos of two into here theta is not there. Actually, two theta is there. So you have to write two theta divided by two, three theta. So it will equal to two. You multiply it here. So three a square divided by four. Integral zero to pi by two, one minus cos four theta into d theta. So three a square by four is integration of this. How much? Theta minus sine four theta by four. Zero to pi by two. Pi by two. This substitute this value. How much you get? Three a square by four. Apply the limits. Pi by two minus zero minus of zero minus zero. Why have put zero here? Sine of four theta. Four into pi by two. So sine two pi value zero. Okay. So this one is equal to what is the answer? Three a square divided by four into two will get eight. So which is nothing but area of three a square pi. Ah, uh, three a square pi. Three a square pi, which is equal to area of given asteroid. Fine. So go through it once again. If you get any doubts? Just let me know.
fine. You go for next one. Yes, sir. Okay. So check this. Sir, so, once your last slide, sir. One minute. Mm. Yes, sir. Thank you. So here, I think this is easy problem. So evaluate integral x y minus x square dx plus x square by dy, where c is a closed curve formed by y equal to zero, x equal to one, and y equal to x. Okay. and directly as a line integral we need to solve and by green theorem we have to solve okay so both we need to use this in this problem okay so let us see given first i'll solve by line integral f dot r f dot dr sorry f dot dr is equal to how much x y minus x square into d x plus x square y d y. Okay. Now given curves. Given curves are y equal to zero. Next x equal to one. Next y equal to x. Okay. now we have to draw these curves so that we will get a clarity on what area we are going to find okay so what is x equal to 0 what is x equal to 0 this is x axis right so x axis is nothing but x equal to sorry y equal to 0 okay similarly x equal to 1 where does it will come here right somewhere x value so i have to draw the equation of that line okay so how it will be it's a parallel line through this parallel line for y axis So this is nothing but x equal to one. Next, y equal to x. Y equal to x means middle to x and y axis. So straight line middle to x and y axis. So this line is nothing but you are y equal to x. Okay. So now we need to find this area. okay so let us see how to find this so that means you need to uh, how will you find through line integral so how will you find first we need to find the intersection point of this area okay so intersection point how you will get means here x equal to 1 is there already implies y equal to x y equal to 1 is substitute okay so when x equal to 1 implies y equal to 1 because of this y equal to x okay so this point is 1 comma 1 now after finding this intersection point find integration along this line so that means through this line you'll find and through this line you'll find and through this line you'll find so you are starting from x axis next we are going through x equal to 1 and you are coming back through y equal to x line okay so integration along first i'll uh, denote this with some point a here b okay so o a b 
So this is a triangle OAB. I am first. I am trying to find area along OE. Okay. So on OE, on OE. So what we have taken y equal to zero, right? So that is a condition we are having on OE. So implies dy equal to zero. Okay. So therefore f dot dr. Is equal to take this as equation one. You can write at the end from equation one. So put y equal to zero here. So I'll get zero minus x square into dx. Okay, plus zero. Okay, so this is from equation one. So this is nothing but minus x square dx. I'll get. So. F dot dr along OA direction is minus x square dx. So apply integration with respect to x. Integral f dot dr. So what are the limits for x? Here in the place of curve, I'll write OA. Limits for x. Along OA, what are the limits for x? Is Fauzia? Can you tell? Yes, sir. Zero to yes. one. Zero to one. Zero to Yes, yes. Zero to one will get. So zero to one uh, minus x square dx. So I'll get minus x square by two. Limits are from zero to one. So what are the limits? So how much will get integration along OA? Will get minus one by two. Okay. So take this as equation. Now, integration along AB direction or AB line. So, on AB line, what it is? X equal to one, right? So, implies dx equal to zero. Substitute these values in f dot dr. So. From this, f dot dr is equal to how much will get? X equal to one. You have to substitute. So one into y Sir. minus one square. Sir. Yes. In yes, yes. Integration of x square uh, x cube by three. Ah, oh, sorry, x cube by three. So I keep as it is. Is minus one by three. Next. So, one into x minus one square into zero plus x square. It is one square y dy. Okay. So implies how much you'll get? F dot dr is equal to dx equal to zero. We'll get y dy. Y dy. So apply integration on both sides. We'll get f dot dr is equal to integral y dy. Limits are from y ranges from where to where? Zero to one. So zero to one again. dy. So we'll get y square by two. Zero to one. Okay, so implies this is a b. So integral f dot d r along the line a b is equal to one by two minus zero. So you'll get one by two. 
so this is equation 3 okay now we need to find uh, along from b to o okay so integration along b o b o line okay so here on b o line what is it y equal to x you are taking okay so implies dy equal to dx now your wish whether you want to convert y in terms of x or x in terms of y so depends on this you can write d r f dot dr so here also you can you have to write from equation 1 next here also we need to write from equation 1 okay so f dot dr f dot dr is x y minus x square so i will convert y in terms of x only so x into x minus x square into dx plus plus or minus so plus x square into x dx so f dot dr is equal to first term you'll get zero you'll get x cube dx so integrate on both sides integral f dot dr is equal to integral x cube dx limits are from 1 to 0. So, 1 to 0. So, this one is equal to x power 4 by 4. Limits are from 1 to 0. So, answer is? Minus 1 by 4. Minus 1 by 4. So, here uh, we have to write B O. So, therefore, integral along the line B O f dot dr is equal to minus 1 by 4 okay so therefore the total area is integral along the curve c f dot dr is equal to integral along oa direction or oa line f dot dr plus integral uh, AB line F dot DR plus integral BO F dot DR. So this one is equal to first value how much you got minus 1 by 3 plus 1 by Next, minus 1 by 4. Okay. So, LCM is how much? I think 12. Okay. So, minus 4 you will get. Plus 6 you will get. Minus 3 you will get. So, what is the answer? Minus 1 by 12. So, integral C f dot dr value you will get it as minus 1 by 12 okay so integral f dot dr is equal to minus 1 by 12 fine now we have to we have to prove the same answer by green's theorem okay so Second uh, problem, and then that means second sub question that is B question by Green's theorem. So, integral m dx plus n dy, okay, around the curve C is equal to over a region R dou n by dou x minus dou m by dou y 
dx dy. Okay. So what is m value from this? So in the given question, in f the x square, x y minus x square. Similarly, n value x square y. Correct. X square y. So implies do m by do y is equal to one. Sorry, it is x. See, similarly, do n by do x two x y. Okay. So implies double integral do n by do x minus do m by do y. Okay, so over a region R is equal to double integral two x minus sorry two x y minus x dx dy. Okay, so do n by do x value is two x y minus x dx dy have written. Now we need to write the limits. Okay, so if you observe this diagram, so try to rewrite the diagram once again. So this one is a coordinate axis. Okay, so this is y equal to x line, and this is x equal to one line. y equal to x and this point is 1 comma 1 okay this is o a b okay now in the outer integral what are the limits outer integral means dy so whenever you thinking in dy you have to think in vertical direction so from vertical direction where does this region is starting in terms of numbers you have to tell So, what are the limits for y? From where it is starting? Zero to one. So, I will get zero to one here, because in origin point it is zero. On x-axis also, x equal to zero. So, uh, sorry, y equal to zero. On x-axis, y equal to zero. So, that's why I have written y equal to zero. Similarly, in the point, y value is one. Okay. Next. dx limits so whenever you are finding dx you have to think in horizontal direction y it means in this direction yes x equal to y to x equal to 1 1 okay so in this way you have to write the limits then you can do the integration as usual So integral zero to one. So two y I'll keep as it is. Integrate with respect to x. X square by two minus x square by two. Having the limits from y to one dy is equal to integral zero to one. Uh, two to get cancel. X square y minus x square by two. Having the limits from one to sorry y to one dy. So just apply upper limit and lower limit. How much will get? Y minus one by two. Next minus of y cube. Okay, minus y square by two dy. Okay. So this one is equal to uh, integral zero to one y minus one by two minus y cube plus y square by two. Just do the integration as usual. We'll get y square by two minus y. Sorry, minus y by two. We'll get. Minus y power four by four plus this one 
y cube by 6 will get or 1 by 2 into y cube by 3 limits from 0 to 1 okay so now substitute y equal to 1 in this equation how much will get we'll check 1 by 2 minus 1 by 2 minus 1 by 4 plus 1 by 6 okay so first two terms get cancelled lcm is 12 here minus 3 plus 2 minus 1 by 12 minus 1 by 12 okay so by green's theorem also you got one minus 1 by 12 by line integral also you got minus 1 by 12 so best way is doing by double integral but here one thing is you should have a clarity on this what is it limits that's it if you have a clarity on limits then double integral is the best way but he is asked us to show both so we have shown both okay so we'll have an attendance what's the next class SIP. SIP. Link shared already? Yes, sir. Morning only. Yes, sir. Okay, one minute. Uh, otherwise, I'll take the attendance from this. No, uh, no problem. Okay, my, you can leave. Thank you, sir. I'll take the attendance in this one. Thank you, sir. Thank you, sir. Fine. Thank you, sir.